YouTube, we're back again with the, what do I call it? The world's biggest penny stove. <laughs> um, I'm making modifications now to try and make it uh, heat up a bit faster. So let's have a look. Right there she is. I've, uh, I've drilled holes all around the bottom like that. And this bit of ring this ring was part of this that went there so i'm going to fix this uh, on the bottom like that oh let's kneel down my old knees yeah we're going to fix this on the bottom to raise it up so we've got a bit of room this is for oxygen and we're going to put a little pot under there maybe that There you go. We can put some uh, alcohol in that and get it going. This will be over the top, hopefully. And it'll act to warm the bottom so that you get the vaporization of the fuel quicker. Yeah, that's the theory anyway. There's another pot there, which I can cut down. A bit of old stainless is a bit high, I think. Yeah, it's a bit high. Yeah. And then if that works, I can actually like put some bars across or something. And so this is mounted, you know, you can actually like, uh, I don't know. Do I need to bother with all that? God knows. Anyway, I'm going to put that on there, weld it around then i'll need to make some sort of bars to go across the top to raise a cooking pot up but at the moment it's another test so weld this on i think i'll put that underneath and we'll see how long it takes to bloom we'll get the phone on the timer or the timer on the phone and we'll uh, we'll see what it does so let's weld this on and give it a go So that's done. The welding's done. Terrible welding. But I've welded it on. Welded that ring on the bottom. Got my vent holes and I've given it a spray of high temperature paint just to stop it going rusty. <coughs> so let's uh, give it a test. So what we've got here is the stove there's a little tray there and I'm gonna put a bit of methylated spirits in it which is ethanol basically just a bit I don't know that'll do let's try that we're gonna light that and in here this is now just under 300 milliliters of ethanol so let's put that much in 300 mils i wouldn't want to really put much more than that you could probably put 600 mil in that would probably be okay but yeah that's quite a bit so let's light this oh hang on let's get the phone going as a timer eh let's get a timer on the phone there you are. I'll prop it up on a brick. Proper low tech. So let's light this. Put it over the top. Start the timer. She's lit. How long will this take? It won't be 20 minutes like last time, I hope. Is it burning underneath? Is it? No, it's gone out.
Oh, God. Now it's burning. 59, 60, right. That's one minute. So, in theory, the little alcohol tray underneath is heating the alcohol inside a lot faster and we should see some results. Two minutes. Two minutes so far. It's still burning underneath, still warming the fuel. Let's hope it doesn't take 20 minutes like last time. Three minutes, 20 seconds, and it's already trying. It's trying to bloom. That's a lot better. Look at it. It's going already. Three minutes, 30. Three minutes, 50. It's pretty much going. I can see the fuel inside is actually boiling. Four minutes, that's it. Let's stop this. There you go. Can you see that? Four minutes and seven seconds I stopped that that timer at. So that's much better. Look at it go. I wish I hadn't put so much fuel in the bottom to be honest. Uh, it doesn't need that anymore. Is it still going? Yeah, still going. Let's hope it doesn't blow up on me. <laughs> right, it's been another five minutes. I've taken the tray out from underneath. Luckily, I've got this little hook here. Which means you can lift it. So, it's calmed down now. Not such a massive flame. The fuel inside, I don't know if you can see, but it's just simmering a little bit. It's not actually a rolling boil like it was before. So, yeah. Literally, it takes three minutes, four minutes to get up to heat to start blooming. And then you're ready to go. I don't know how long it'll burn for. We'll find that out when I start cooking with it. But there you go. It works. Seven inch wide penny stove uh, with a preheat pan underneath. What can I say? It works. That's just right, that is. I like that. Now I've got to snuff it out. Snuff. Give it a second. There you go. She's out. See the fuel simmering inside. So next time I think we'll make a proper lid with a proper, you know, so we can snuff it out properly. Uh, could even make it into a simmer ring. Don't know. So we'll make that. We'll make some pot stands, some bars to go across like this so I can put cooking pot on it and we'll do some cooking i'll let that cool down and then i'm going to pour the pour the fuel away because i don't want to waste it because there's quite a lot but yeah so next time we'll try cooking on it we'll try making some more bits for it finishing it off and actually using it so hopefully i'll see you next time <laughs>